All right, it's still here at Phantom Bikes in San Diego. We were just checking out uh, their gas bikes, but we're checking out now their new e-bike. They've decided the e-bikes definitely match into their scene really good. They are the future. They're clean, clean quiet, no gasoline. They uh, run on uh, five cents of electricity. So uh, they actually uh, base this on their frame that they do use for the gasoline bikes. And that allows that what would be the fuel tank to hold any kind of nice cool beverage or anything you got in mind. Well, let's take a closer look at this. Now they were discussing some changes they're going to be making. Uh, possibly they're working up. Uh, this has uh, the drum brakes in the front, roller brakes in the rear. They might be moving up to discs and even on their gas powered bikes. They try to go with that vintage look. But uh, you know these things are so fast and disc brakes uh, just might have to make it. You know, I had a 1950s car that had disc brakes, so it's not the, they didn't, I don't know if they, when they first started them, ha having them. Now, as you'll see, that Phantom Bike says, uh, has taken the 8-fung mid-drive and adapted to their custom frame. Got the nice big battery. And so, 8-fung uh, is really, you know, a real dependable, uh, well-engineered mid-drive setup. And also it works through the gears, so it allows the flexibility, uh, the torque, and the uh, uh, power of the motor to be used better. So this is their first uh, uh, deal here. Got the three-speed Nexus in the back with a roller brake. Fully fendered, nice big cruiser seat. Working off that mid-drive. Some clean lines in this baby, Springer fork. So there's the three-speed shifter. And of course, uh, uh, those displays really give a lot of information. Right here is your uh, on and off and your uh, parameter setting and left-hand throttle on this. And like I say, they're still working out the details, but they have decided e-bikes fit way into the world and way into their, their deal. So uh, now you can find Phantom Bikes online or you know on Facebook here in San Diego. Now their gas-powered bikes are sold all over the world. And I'm sure that's what they're thinking with this e-bike. So I don't know if you're really catching the details, but just how clean and how much attention to detail they're going here. They're working on a little better uh, wire routing. They also have most of it going through the uh, chassis, but little by little, they'll get things just the way they want. As, I, as, I, as I'm here, I can see they really, really cover the details. So it looks like uh, they're pretty sure they're going to name their uh, first electric version the Vision. And they have another uh, version they've got planned coming out that's a little more custom with a little more stuff going on. They're still working up a name for that and working up the final details. So this is the Phantom Vision from Phantom Bikes here in San Diego. And it looks like I'm going to get a chance to ride it, so we'll do a little riding video too. And uh, of course these mid-drives have lots of juice, so it should be pretty exciting. Also too, you know, it's just got that classic 20s, 30s style thing going. And uh, it wouldn't surprise me if they end up making these in the down bar versions too, but we'll see uh, what they got in mind. All right, so the uh, Phantom Vision, their fresh, freshly built e-bike, working out the details. The most likely this will be available any day now. All right, well, thanks for watching. Next up, I think the riding, vision, riding video on the Phantom Vision.